In this video I'm going to show how to resolve the boot manager is missing error message in Windows 7. If you're getting this error you're probably seeing it whenever your computer first turns on and attempts to boot into Windows and if you hit Control delete it just keeps taking you back to boot manager is missing. This problem is typically pretty easy to resolve. All you need is the Windows 7 install DVD. Just insert the disk into your computer's drive and then hit Control alt delete to reboot. At this screen, if you're on a Dell machine, you'll have to hit F12. For HP, I think it's F10. And since I'm on a virtual machine, I'll just hit the escape key to select the boot device. Just select your CD-ROM drive and hit enter. Then at this screen, you just have to hit a key so that it'll boot from CD. After your computer's finished booting to the CD, you'll see this screen. Go ahead and click on next. Click on repair your computer. It'll take a few seconds as it searches for your install of Windows. Just make sure that Windows 7 and the C drive here is selected and then click on next. Click on startup repair. Once startup repair begins, it will run for a few minutes. It does everything automatically so you don't really have to babysit it. And after startup repair completes, you'll see this screen. Just click on the finish button to reboot your computer. So it appears that startup repair was able to successfully resolve the missing boot manager issue. And after the repair is finished, my computer was able to successfully boot into Windows. Hit the like button if this video was helpful, and thanks for viewing.